Hi guys, this is Neha. Welcome to another video of targetstudy.com. Today I will be talking about one of the most sought after medical course that is Diploma in Pharmacy. Diploma in Pharmacy is three years undergraduate medical course. In this course, you learn about preparation, dispensing and appropriate use of medication for therapeutic purposes. The Pharmacy Council of India is a regulatory body of pharmacy education in India. To join this course, you should have completed 10 plus 2 with physics, chemistry and biology as main subjects. Some reputed institutes may also demand a certain minimum percentage to provide admission to this course. To get admission to this course, you need to clear entrance exams like Diploma Entrance Test of Hamdard University. However, some institutes do provide admission to this course on the basis of marks in the qualifying exam. Some of such entrance tests conducted in India are Graduate Pharmacy Aptitude Test, UPSC, JEE Pharmacy, AU, AIM, E Pharmacy. Some of the reputed institutes that you think of getting admission into are Jamia Hamdard University, New Delhi, Bundelkhan University, Chansi, Amity Institute of Pharmacy, Mumbai, and Delhi Institute of Pharmaceutical Sciences and Research in New Delhi. In this course, you will study about various aspects of pharmacy, such as pharmaceutics, pharmaceutical chemistry, biochemistry and clinical pathology, human anatomy, health education, and community pharmacy, etc. Pharmacy syllabus is designed in such a way that it includes both practical and theory subjects. The course prepares students to assist in narcotics control, third-party billing, drug distribution, pre-packing pharmaceuticals, computer processing, and clerical and other duties as necessary. Candidates with diploma in pharmacy have brighter career prospects due to its demand, not only in India, but also in developed countries like Canada, America, after completing this course successfully, you can get jobs in hospitals, health centers, chemist shops, pharmaceutical firms, research agencies, food and drug administration, etc. as technical supervisor, medical transcriptionist, and pharmacist, etc. This is all from this video guys. I hope you find this video informative. For more such videos, do subscribe to our guest study YouTube channel. Thank you for watching. Good luck.